check, tubo check, podcast check. Oh, it's almost finished. Carry them 
must be somewhere I can put this. Ah, uh, just one more gap. Um. There we go. Now that is a perfect pyramid. That's odd. Someone's covered the entrance. Left. I need to fill that gap up there with one more regular stone. Then this capstone goes on top. Oh, so where's the other stone? Are you sure you bought the right amount, Susan? I never miscount. Counting is my thing. Reminds me of the time I was counting camels in the Sahara Desert. The camels tend to wander off, stones don't wander off. Bob might know where the stone is, but where is Bob? And where is Frankie? And the niche. <laughs> you know, in ancient times, people were often sealed inside pyramids forever. <sighs> with only mummies for company. Uh, thanks, Anish. Any idea how we get out there? I'll try Leo. <sighs> My phone's not working. The walls must be too thick. They're blocking the signal. Then we'll have to try something else. Well, they're not in there. Of course, they all went inside the pyramid. I'll go get them. Um, uh, um. I've gone all the way around, but I can't see the entrance anywhere. It has to be there. It can't have vanished. No, but it... Uh, you. I think I knew where the missing stone went. I thought I saw a gap that needed filling, so I filled it. You blocked the entrance? Well then, we need to unblock it. Yes, but I can't remember where the entrance was. Uh, neither can I. No me. Okay, what to do? What to do? Um, we'll just have to remove some of the stones until we find it.
but with Tiny, of course. We're the best cream team in Spring City. Well, Anish, I'm so looking forward to seeing this wonderful exhibition. Let's make sure we give that entrance a door you can open from the inside. 